Hi Grade 10. I always think of Grade 10 as a transition year. And now, Term 2 is the time to start thinking about what your next steps are come the end of the year. A number of you will be thinking about transitioning out of school and entering the workforce. Others will be thinking about continuing and completing Year 11 and 12. Regardless of the pathway that you're hoping to follow, it's important that we come up with a bit of a plan to make sure that you can get where you need to go. If you are thinking about continuing and completing Year 11 and 12 at our school, our teachers have been working hard to create videos to outline what each subject involves. I encourage you to have a look at these videos which are found on our eLearn course. In addition to this, there is also the Year 11 subject guide which breaks down each subject, identifies what content is being covered in each unit and the different types of assessment. It will also outline any prerequisites for learning as well. When you're looking through the subjects in the course guide, it will tell you if it's an applied subject, a general subject, or a vocational education and training course, also known as a VET course. Regardless of the subjects you choose, all students in year 11 and 12 work towards the Queensland Certificate of Education, also known as the QCE, while some students work towards the Queensland Certificate of Individualised Achievement, the QCIA. For more information, about the QCE or QCIA, I encourage you to have a look at the Queensland Curriculum and Assessment Authority webpage. If you are thinking that at the end of grade 11 and 12, you would like to continue on to university, the fastest pathway is through an ATAR ranking. ATAR stands for Australian Tertiary Admission Rank. And this is a ranking system used to enter university. In order to be ATAR eligible in grade 11 and 12, you must complete four general subjects. It's important for you to keep this in mind when you're thinking about the subjects that you might decide to choose when you hit year 11 and 12. If you have any questions about year 11 subjects, please don't hesitate to give me a call or send me an email. Even though we can't be together in person at school, I'm only a phone call or an email away. I will be putting out another video breaking down the Queensland Certificate of Education and the ATAR and give you some examples so you know what they involve. In the meantime, I encourage you to just look at the videos, read through the subject guide and think about what subjects will appeal to you. The best advice I can give you in regards to choosing subjects is one, that you choose subjects that you enjoy doing and two, you choose subjects that you think you're going to be successful in. Okay, it's over to you. Have a look through those videos. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give me a call or send me an email.